Hello traders, you are welcome to my new series of market structure a step further and this is going to be part one of the series. In this part we are going to be focusing on selection of point of interest. This is quite very simple and yet powerful. On the screen we have a bullish schematic so price is in an uptrend because we are making bullish break of structures so like I said here the first thing you need to do is to focus on the entire swing that clear liquidity as you can see this is the entire swing here that clear liquidity and then break structure to the upside so when you have that swing you can select it the whole of that swing as your point of interest and that is going to be our overall point of interest okay what it means is that this becomes a strong low and you don't expect price to trade below this low whatever price does when it is mitigating this move you know this sell to buy move you don't expect price to trade below this low and as you can see along the expansion you can spot refined area of interest or point of interest as well or you may even end up scaling or, or scaling to a lower a lower time frame you know where you can find more refined uh, zones demand zones in this case where you can actually trade from once again you can see if you mark this zone for instance there could be an opportunity once again for you to trade from if you look at this move this entire move cleared liquidity and break structure to the upside you mark that as your point of interest your new overall point of interest then like we did here along this expansion move you can as well identify a more refined point of interest we expect price to mitigate and repass from and possibly this is going to be your target which is the weak high in this case so the main point here is first of all focus on the entire swing that manipulated the low in this case or that manipulated the high in case of a bearish scenario so we quickly look at the rechart and see how we can explain this further so we are now on the rechart this is actually GBP USD and we are on the 15 minutes time frame and price is clearly in the downtrend. Okay, so we are going to focus on this move that clear liquidity. Here you can see it very clearly. Clear liquidity manipulated this is high and place it at high and then have a break of structure to the downside from here this is the move we have a break of structure here I hope that is clear enough this move manipulated is high and then we have a break of structure, break of this move, we trade lower 
and below okay that means we are going to mark this as our overall POI in this case all right and you can see how price actually came and reacted from the POI down here once again if you look closely the scenario repeated itself we have this move clearing this liquidity here we mark it so that you see right and then we have a break of structure here and the break of structure of the move and you can refer to it as change of character okay change of character and then what it means we have a new point of interest here and we can mark and if we drag this keep dragging it you see our price has already reacted from that point oh yes we can always refine it we can always refine it for instance you can choose the last buy to sell candle, or you can even trade from the body to get a better refined entry. The same thing my applier will find this as the case may be. Of course, you can get your own entry as well. So that's the point we are just trying to make in this video where you can easily pick points so the same thing happened here we have this move very liquidity and we have a break of structure so we can pick this POI see what happened we tapped on it just like that so that's one of the easy way we can actually get our POIs that's a point I really want to make in this video so with that I believe you've got in some value watch out for part two we have shot well deeper thank you and have a good trading